Hi guys. All right. This is the second time I'm recording this because for some reason in my last recording, the screen was completely blank. It was really weird. So I'm going to try this again. If this doesn't work and the screen is blank, I'm sorry. I apologize. I do not know why it's not working, but if it's working, then awesome. All right. So I wanted to start with reading the questions first, because that is a huge strategy that you're going to be using in middle school next year. So after we read this letter, which we're going to read together, um, you are going to fill out this Google form, um, your name. And it says, in only a few words, describe the relationship between AC and KG. And no, this is not Ashlyn Charbonneau. Ashlyn, do not panic. All right. What complaints does AC have against KG? And what is going to happen to these two people in the future? So those are the things you really want to have in your head as you're reading the letter. So let me get to the letter. All right. So dear KG, I'm not sure how to start this letter, but I feel we need to talk. I've been thinking about us a lot lately. Things used to be so great. It was like we were made for each other. I mean, everyone said it was perfect. I thought we would be together forever. But then things changed. Please make sure you're in your teenage angst mode brain right now because this is so cheesy. Our relationship should be give and take. But recently, you've just seemed to take. I mean, you do whatever you want and you don't ask me about my own feelings or what I want. I don't think you ever took into consideration my feelings when you make decisions for us. And it seems like you've made all of the decisions some of the things that I would like to point out specifically that have upset me in the past few months include, you have always been choosing how much sugar I can eat and pop I can drink, telling me where I can and cannot go, and even controlling what I read. I have tried to make this work, giving you too many opportunities to change your ways. And yes, it is true that you have fixed some of our problems, but overall, you just seem to focus on changing the little stuff. You haven't made any attempts to work on some big issues. I've been thinking about this for a while. And while I don't want to hurt you, I think it's time that we ended this. I mean, it's just not going to work. I need some time by myself to see what it's like on my own. You were always making me do things you wanted to do and never let me have my own voice. I'm sorry things didn't work out, but I gave you time to change and you didn't. You are the one to blame for this. Sorry, but us is over. Signed, AC. AC sounds pretty upset. Whoops. So again, your questions are, in only a few words, describe the relationship between AC and KG. And tell me what complaints does AC have against KG? So what are they complaining about? What are those specific things they're upset about? And what is going to happen between these two people in the future? All right. So that's all for today. Have a fantastic day and hopefully this recorded. See you later.